Okay, everybody, look at all that. That is just insane. Look at that guy. Look at that guy. So just don't drink the water and I'm fine. Face, my face, like the quivering of lightning in the heavy load. So I woke up about an hour and a half late. For the first time ever, when I hit snooze, my alarm didn't come back on. And I, 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 I'm dumbfounded. I have no idea how that happened. I don't even think I hit snooze. I remember reaching for it, but that's it. So I woke up late. It is now 11.30. I wanted to be on the road at 10. Um, everything's packed up. I'm just gonna pound another cup of coffee real quick here and then i'm going to be heading out two and a half hours into the desert oh let me show you what um everything looks like so everything i'm selling of mine is fitting in this bag bunch of the um these aren't mine these are things i'm going to use in the thing but a bunch of my um, chapbooks, a bunch of my paperbacks. Um, yeah, so this is all my merchandise. Folding this fucking table up and taking it, getting ready to take it to Lit Fest. This has been cathartic as fuck because this is the table I sit at a lot and do work on and paint on. And now the table is folded and I'm getting it the fuck out of my house. So that tells me there's a good possibility that I'm getting things out of my house and that feels good. Okay, everybody, here is what just happened. So, um, I, being the brilliant motherfucker that I am, forgot that, that today is Friday, which completely makes sense because I knew it was gonna be Friday all week. But this is also the end of March. This is the beginning of motherfuckers spring break. So going out to the desert at noon on a Friday at the end of March, I'm fucked. I have a sneaking suspicion that once we get to over where the 57 meets the 10, um, I am not going to be moving because everyone and their mom is either going to be going to Palm Springs or to Vegas. And the funny thing about that is, is that I don't know if anyone's actually going to this lit fest. I'm hoping they are. But um, I completely spaced. So even though I'm leaving way early, it might not be early enough. Look how open the freeway is right now. Fingers crossed that this is exactly what it stays like. It didn't even take a whole cigarette before the freeway just came to a fucking complete stop. Oh, look at this fucking motherfucker. Okay, it's picking up a little bit, but um, yeah, I was stopped for a minute. Oh yeah, this is picking up a little bit. Maybe it's not that bad. And traffic stopped again, um, but that's okay. Uh, Every time I turn the camera on, it starts moving again. So I might just leave the camera on. But I got my table next to me. Ah, so that's fun. And I think, not 100%, but I was walking through some tall grass to get everything loaded up in the car because I had to double park. And so now my hypochondria and paranoia is making me think there are millions of fleas and ticks burrowing into my ankles right now. Which I know probably isn't true, but I'm terrified now and I don't know what to do. And I'm in the fast lane, so it's not like I'm gonna be able to pull over to check my ankles. So I'm just frantically squatting them with my feet. Um, yeah, so this is fucked. This is gonna take forever 
to get there. But, you know, it's okay. It'll be a fun adventure. And I don't know if you guys know this. Well, you probably don't because I haven't told you anything about this yet. But, I don't have a place to stay out there yet. And I was told that if you don't book in advance, you're not going to find a place to stay. And then there was a part of me that wanted to camp out there um, because of the beach and everything. And then I was informed that the beach is poisonous and um, like you'll get really sick if you camp at the beach. So I don't know what the fuck that means. I don't know what's going on. But, um, you know, that's the best place to have a lit fest, I think. Um, if you can't make someone sick by coming to your fucking book fair, I don't know what the fuck you're doing. And this is the exact spot where I feared everything would go to shit. And here we are. <laughs> Self-fulfilling prophecy, guys. I fucking did this. This is completely my fault. Oh, man. And we are going to be coming to a complete stop right about now. Complete stop on the freeway. Motherfucker. Ah, so here we are. Um, and it is 1245, so it's only been 45 minutes. So that means there's still like two hours at least. So we'll see how this goes. So we are now in the land of white pickup trucks with American flag stickers that say so many things. Like this one says American by birth, redneck by choice. I believe it. I fucking believe it. So anyway, so if you are one of those people that love living in a town full of raised white pickup trucks with American flag stickers. Um, this is the area for you. first traffic light in um, a couple hours. So I don't know if you're going to be able to see this good, but there are, I don't know if these are just like palm tree farms or what the fuck, but there's just like acres and acres of palm trees all over the place over here. And um, it's kind of crazy. I like it. Definitely 
that. That is just insane. I had no idea. For some reason, I thought this was um, dried up and then there were little parts where there was actual water. Because I know there's like a canal area. It's like a crazy furry animal. This is just nuts. I, I just can't fucking believe this. This is just crazy. The sun feels so fucking good. The heat feels so good. Oh, and then this is another reason why having a Honda Element is amazing. Because you have the two doors, you get in there, and it hides you from pissing. Because I just took the longest piss in the history of forever, and it was fucking awesome. So I think there's a part of me that thinks I might want to stay out here a little longer than I had planned. Look at that. It is so amazing out there. Can you see that? I might stay out here a little longer than I planned just to uh, check out all the stuff there is to do out here. Because, like, I don't know. I've lived fucking in Southern California my whole life and I've never been here before because I just thought it was something that it wasn't, you know? So, I don't know, I'm about uh, 10 minutes from town. So, yeah, let's, let's get in here and do this. I'm fucking excited. Ah, woo! Apparently, um, I just, is this a place to eat? Oh my gosh, yeah. Um, this is awesome. Shirtless dude hit me up and gave me a map. Um, and that's a bar. That's awesome. Oh, and it's like a total actual little town. Okay. Cool, cool. And I guess this is a bunch of... Any of this is. Oh, and that's a museum. And hot dogs. Hell yeah. Um, I have no idea what I'm doing. Wow, look at this fucking place. This is insane. And then I guess you go up there for some other shit. Oh, wow. I guess you could go up there. I guess I'm just gonna be walking around for a bit, guys. This looks fucking amazing. This looks great. Yeah, this place. I remember they shot some movies out here that were like really kind of dystopian, kind of scary shit. Um, yeah, I guess so. I know there's some art show here. What's that say? Resort? Alright. Last resort. Again, there's that thing. So I'm definitely going to hit the barbecue place. And then I'm definitely hitting the bar. And then I will figure out what I'm doing next. Take a look at this. So you have like a gumball shrine and then like the little check-in thing. This is awesome.
we're like, and there was the, always that worm in it. Yeah, yeah. Because the worm goes yes. really got it. Yes. Oh my god! One time I tasted it, and it was just it was the worst thing I've ever tasted. You know what I mean? <laughs> Yeah. I've had that reach around. Sorry, guys. You just <laughs> <laughs> I was just gonna say, is, is that what happens when you drink this tequila? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. that's what I'm saying. I'm like, this is awesome. <laughs> 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 oh shit! Yeah, for real, for real, for real. I was like, wow, this is amazing stuff. Yeah, bottle Right. I don't have an issue with this. Okay, but I'm trying to get right through this. So don't drink the water and I'm fine. Don't drink the water, just drink alcohol. Yeah. Well, sanitize you. <laughs> oh, no shit. Water. No, a mannequin. Or is that really a person? Whoa. Wow. Yeah, that's the show. That's a big fucking stage, dude. I feel like we walked in the wrong way. Ah, oh, shit. Let's figure this out. Hello. Wow. Oh. The eating torch is still there and there's All right. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Do you guys have stuff to drink? What's your bias? No, it's okay. I wasn't trying to drink your drink. I was just asking you because I'm just like looking around. Yeah, you're you're doing great. Never mind. Pretend I wasn't here. Okay. I'm gonna look at this sign over here. You guys are doing wonderful. You are. Good job. Have a wonderful night. Is this a real person or is this a statue? Oh shit. Let me go interview the real person. Are you a real person over here? I am. Holy shit, I thought you were like a statue. Nope. Are you guarding the sign? No, I'm just standing here. Oh, shit. It's good at the view. <laughs> All right, it's a good view. Yes. Um, yeah, so you're not guarding the sign. No, I'm just walking around. Okay, well, good. I'm just walking around, too. Okay. A lot to see. Yeah, I was going to interview you about guarding the sign, but you're not <laughs> doing that, so I'm not going to do that. Yeah, How long have you been here today? Well, I live here. Oh, you live here, so everything's fine. Okay. Well, you're killing it. Good job. I'm fine. <laughs> what is the best thing you've wandered around and seen since you've been here? Oh, it's hard to pick just one. Okay, pick four. Or what's the first thing that comes to your mind? Well, I went to the yacht club. There's a yacht club? There's a yacht club okay. over on North Shore. No, there's a yacht club near. The Bombay That's Beach Yacht too? Club. Oh, shit. Um, it's over there on 2nd Street. Um, there's also, I went wandered by a drag show. Really? There's an opera house. An opera house? There's all kinds of weirdness going on. I've, I've been sitting in a bar for a Shout out to regular hours. guy. Uh, Shout out to regular guy. You're missing the show. What, what's happening over here? Is there someone about there, to jump? There's a girl going to jump. Oh, is she going to jump? Okay, I'm going to watch. I'm going to watch. My question for you guys is, I'm sorry. My, for, my first question is, I'm going to scare the shit out of you. The second question is, were you here to see that person jump? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, then, is that a part of the show? I don't know. Okay. We were just wondering why. So someone is about to jump. How far do they jump? Like, where do they go? Okay, let's go figure this out. Okay. I didn't mean to scare you. I'm really, I'm really sorry. <laughs> hey, I'm sorry. Are you going to jump? Oh, we already had a conversation before. We Shit, we were talking about whiskey. Yeah. Well, now I'm here asking you if you're going to jump. I think that would be a really bad idea. It probably would be, but then why would you be in a predicament to where I would assume that you would jump? Yes, do the thing. Okay, oh. now we're talking. Okay. <laughs> See, I just asked you if you... Look, you jumped and I... Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. Like, are you going to jump? No. Are you going to jump? Yes. Shit, dude. Oh, this is a funny song. Le chant. Le chant. Le chant. La mer. La mer. Ton corps. Ton corps. Ma femme. Ma femme. Ma femme. Le chant. Le chant. Le chant. I'm not a 
And feeling, and feeling no fall from the heights of my own pride. For the mouth which sucked on him was not my own, but my mother's. And all the windings of her thought, and the currents of her senses. And I knew the cock of Set, as she knew it, on the roof garden of my great-grandfather's house above the banks of the Nile. And his flesh was hot, and the smelting pits of a sulfur mine to scorch the flesh of her palate, and was still holding mine, while the fingers of his other hand clasped the head, the back of my head, through my mother's ears. I could hear the unspoken voice of my great-grandfather as he had spoken once to her while her mouth was engorged. And with the throbbing upon her face, my face, like the quivering of lightning in the heavy load. That's fucking heavy shit, dude. I just came here to read some shit home still. <laughs> this is the place to do it. Yeah, and that dude was sexually harassing this drummer. Cool. <laughs> like, I tried, and he won't fuck me. <laughs> What a fucking That's piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Every fucking time. Oh shit. Oh shit. I didn't do it right underneath it. Oh, wait, actually, let me see if I can get your face. Yeah. Have it later. That's... This whole place is kind of fucking amazing. I almost didn't come all the way in here when I hit North Shore. When I hit North Shore, I almost didn't come all the way in. I was just like, I'm just gonna stop and sleep in my car. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Help me. Oh, shit. There we go.
It is like seven o'clock in the morning and I'm supposed to be at the venue at eight to load my table and get everything ready. And I guess have some coffee and stuff. I did not sleep well. I slept right where I'm sitting, you know. But this is a really beautiful place. Um, it was crazy last night. Um, not as crazy as I thought it was going to be, but it was still pretty crazy. But yeah, I guess I'll show you a little bit of the morning here. I probably will show you outside as well. <laughs> Not just from inside the car, but yeah, the sun's coming up over there, or came up over there, or whatever. But yeah. Here it is. So this is where the day's events are going down at the BB Arts Culture.org, I think is how you said it. BBAC. Oh, Bombay Beach Arts Culture. Got it. Yeah, so this is where it's gonna be at. And yeah, it should be really cool. I thought that was yeah. so cool. I was like, actually hear me because the wind is blowing like fucking crazy it's actually raining but there's a blue sky above me and um all sorts of other shit and malarkey um, but i wanted to show you something like going out this way um, there's one thing that i love to do every time no matter how stupid it is every time i do it and that is, look at that guy, look at that guy, and look at that guy. These are the dinosaurs in um, Cabazon, 
from Pee Wee's Big Adventure. one it's had that I recall anyway. So kind of fun, kind of neat. Yeah, there's a gift shop inside. But I am much too easily persuaded, so I will not be doing that. I am fucking exhausted. seven o'clock I uh, unloaded most of the car parked in the garage came home took a shower with a couple of beers and now I'm laying in bed and looking out at the palm tree that I see every morning. That I will actually miss quite a bit when I'm not here. But I'm hoping that to go somewhere where there's so many palm trees. That I couldn't possibly miss this tree. Huh? Huh? That's the plan anyway. So anyhow. It was a good event. I'm glad I went. I'm also glad I'm home and I'm glad I'm in bed. So I hope you enjoyed this. I just want to give a quick thanks to those people who make these videos possible. Anarchy Creo and my followers on Patreon. I appreciate the hell out of you guys. Thank you so much for keeping me going to keep this content possible. You guys are awesome. And if you'd like to join the crew of the Anarchy Crew, just hit the join button beneath this video. And if you'd like to become a member of my Patreon, you can run over to the link down below to do that as well. Thank you.